The college football bowl season officially began today with the fourth annual New Mexico Bowl. Organizers were hoping to attract as many as 30,000 fans, even though no New Mexico team made it to the game this year. So did today's bowl measure up to expectations? News 13's Crystal Gutierrez takes a look. Now, as of Tuesday, 23,000 tickets were sold. New Mexico Bowl officials were hoping to reach 30, but they fell short quite a bit. To make matters worse, New Mexicans didn't help out very much. A uh, little small, a little disappointed by my uh, fellow New Mexico people, but uh, it's not as bad as I thought it might be. A crowd of nearly 25,000 people came out today, and you could give most of the credit to the Wyoming fans. Had they not made the trip, this stadium would nearly be empty. The amount of yellow in the stadium today was blinding, filling up the majority of the east side. Then you look just across the field, and mixed in between empty rows were Fresno State fans, a very small crowd, and some of those in red were actually Lobo fans. Now, both sides have their reasons why Fresno State, the team favored to win, came up short on their fan base. They didn't want to see him get beat. I think that they don't have as far to drive, so, you know, that's why there's probably more of them, but that's okay. Now, one thing's for sure, no matter what color fans were wearing, the out-of-towners bring a whole lot of green to Albuquerque and to UNM. Crystal Gutierrez, KRQE News 13.